Welcome to French Conversations for Beginners. Learn everyday French from Janina, the language teacher, and Joël from France. Bonjour. Welcome to French Conversations for Beginners. Thus far in this course, you've heard French between Janina, me, the American, and Joël from Saint-Étienne, France, from South Central France. Uh, in this course, now that you've progressed a bit, I wanted to expose you to some different speakers, which is a really important part of learning a language because we all have our own unique ways of speaking and our own patterns and our own ways of, of intonating our sentences, etc. But also people from the French speaking world. So in this episode, you're going to hear two entirely different speakers. You're going to hear an exchange between a native French speaker from France and one from Quebec. And in tonight's episode, you're going to hear all about making plans, talking about the post office, and really practical language. Bonjour, my name is Elise, and I am from France. Salut, my name is Ja, and I'm from Quebec, Canada. In today's episode, you will learn French for making plans, talking about the post office, and talking on the telephone. First of all, Ja, can you please tell us the proper way in France to begin a conversation on the phone? Very good question. Well, in France, just like in most of countries on earth, we initiate the discussion by saying bonjour, which means literally good day. It's the most common greeting in everyday situations before sunset. However, if you call someone at the end of the afternoon or at night, it would be definitely more suitable to use the term bonsoir which means good evening. By the way, if you have never met the person you are calling, it would be a good idea to immediately present yourself. As you know, French people may hang up very quickly. Then a ça va or a comment vas-tu aujourd'hui is a good mise en bouche towards the next step of the discussion. Okay, I think everybody is able to do that. Now, how can we invite someone to have a coffee, some croissant, or French wine on a terrace in order to get to know her or him better? So, when you are sure that you are not disturbing your future friend, you can propose to him or her an invitation in several places, like a good restaurant or a bar you are used to. Next step is to set up a meeting hour. Not too early, but not too late. The ideal moment is around 10 or 11 o'clock a.m. or at 6 o'clock p.m. It's the happy hour time. Please note that I use the word propose. Be careful and avoid the direct no for answer by mentioning that you are also flexible and can adapt yourself to her or him. As you know, some of French people, especially native Parisians, don't like to feel pressured. And now, let's hear the dialogue. Où retrouvons-nous Christiane ce soir? Je ne sais pas. Si je lui téléphonais. C'est ça. Et pendant que vous l'appelez, je vais à la poste. Vous avez son numéro? Je vais regarder. C'est Danton 79-67. Allô, je voudrais parler à Mademoiselle Mercier. Bien, monsieur. C'est de la part de qui Roger Dumont. Ne quittez pas, monsieur. Je vais voir si elle est là. Allô, Roger Bonjour, Christiane. J'avais peur de ne pas vous trouver. Où nous retrouvons-nous ce soir Voulez-vous venir me chercher vers 7 heures D'accord. À tout à l'heure. Où puis-je envoyer une lettre par avion Ici même, monsieur. Je vais la peser. Et pour les paquets recommandés C'est au guichet 12. Je voulais aussi envoyer un fax, mais il y a trop de monde au guichet. Pourquoi ne l'envoyez-vous pas de chez vous Je ne savais pas qu'on pouvait le faire de chez soi. Si, vous pouvez téléphoner le texte. Now, let's break down the words and phrases we heard in this conversation. How do you say, where are we meeting Christian this evening? In French. In French, we say, où retrouvons-nous Christian ce soir? How do you say, I don't know, suppose I phone her, in French. In French, we say, je ne sais pas, si je lui téléphonais. How do you say, fine, and while you call her, I'm going to the post office, in French. In French, we say, c'est ça, et pendant que vous l'appelez, je vais à la poste. How do you say, you have her number, in French. In French, we say, vous avez son numéro. How do you say, I'll go look, it's Danton. 79-67, in French. In French, we say, je vais regarder. C'est Danton, 
How do you say hello? I'd like to talk to Miss Mercier in French. In French, we say allô. Je voudrais parler à Mademoiselle Mercier. How do you say yes, sir? Who's calling in French? In French, we say bien, monsieur. C'est de la part de qui? How do you say hold the line, sir? I'll go see if she's here in French. In French, we say ne quittez pas, monsieur. Je vais voir si elle est là. How do you say hello in French? In French, we say allô? How do you say I was afraid I wouldn't reach you in French? In French, we say j'avais peur de ne pas vous trouver. How do you say where are we meeting this evening in French? In French, we say où nous retrouvons-nous ce soir? How do you say would you come by and pick me up around seven in French? In French, we say Voulez-vous venir me chercher vers 7 heures? How do you say OK, see you later in French? In French, we say D'accord, à tout à l'heure. How do you say Where can I send a letter in French? In French, we say Où puis-je envoyer une lettre? How do you say Right here, sir, I'll wait it in French? In French, we say Ici même, monsieur, je vais la peser. How do you say And for registered packages in French. In French, we say et pour les paquets recommandés. How do you say that's at window 12 in French? In French, we say c'est au guichet 12. How do you say I also wanted to send a fax in French? In French, we say je voulais aussi envoyer un fax. How do you say but there are too many people at the window in French? In French. We say trop de monde au guichet. How do you say why don't you send it from home in French? In French, we say pourquoi vous ne l'envoyez-vous pas de chez vous? How do you say I didn't know you could do that from home in French? In French, we say je ne savais pas qu'on pouvait le faire de chez soi. How do you say yes you can phone in French? In French, we say si vous pouvez téléphoner. Until next time, à la prochaine. À bientôt. For more resources on learning and teaching languages, to get on our mailing list, or to get the workbook for this course, be sure to visit reallifelanguage.com slash reallifelanguageblog. If you enjoyed this episode, please be sure to subscribe and leave a rating.